And we are back uh, to another video playing Persona 5 Strikers. Lanjut lagi sampai sini kemarin. I'm quite nauseous as well. Symptoms processed. You have what you call hangovers. Is that right? Uh, soda doesn't give people hangovers. It's more like that one stuffed his face too much and that one whacked his head on the ceiling when he got too rowdy. Oh. I understand. Seriously, don't misinform Sophia with such stupidity. <laughs> Sounds like you damn kids are just as rambunctious as ever. Zanchichi! We saw the news. Nice work bringing in Kanoe. Thank you for all your efforts. <laughs> That's okay. Yep. But there's still one last perp I've got to bring in. That's right. Owada. I'm flying back to Tokyo pretty soon. Sounds like we'll be going our separate ways for now. <laughs> that doesn't sound half bad. Well, I do still have some time left. I suppose I should send my partners off right. Speaking of which... Got a sec? Hmm. Well, in that case... Oh, ternyata kalian ada. Tetap aja ya. Terima kasih sudah menonton. Jangan lupa like, share, dan subscribe. Sampai jumpa di selanjutnya. Bye-bye. Halo semuanya, balik lagi bareng sama gua Abi. Kita lanjut lagi main personal 5 striker sekali ini kita akan kembali ke Tokyo. Itu ada pilihannya itu go to the next city. Nah, biar enggak usah lama-lama, langsung aja kita cao balik ke Tokyo. Oke, okay, got it. Let's go. Salah. Kita mau matiin servernya Emma setelah pengakuan dari Akira Konoe. I really do appreciate everything you did Phantom Thieves. Let me say this one last time. Thank you for rescuing Akane. And me too. <laughs> you really are something. So you're going to arrest Owada? You know it. I swear I'm going to throw every crime he's committed right in his face. I'm sure he's wigging out and trying to hide behind some other badges. But that won't stop my boss. He'll get him cornered no matter what. Mm-hmm. Peachy. Don't let him slip away from you. Who do you think you're talking to? I'm the rising star at PubSec now. Say hello to Okane-chan for us as well. Sure. And stop on by whenever you want. I know Okane'd be thrilled. Your next visit will be a lot more easy going. I'll even show you around Kyoto. <laughs> well, see you. See ya, Papa Zenkichi. Hati-hati. Jadi Papa Zen Kichi ini mau ngelaporin Oh ada. Uh, there he goes. Yes. To finally finish this. I'm sure he'll see it through to its proper end. We should get back to Tokyo ourselves too. I can only imagine how worried Boss must be. Ready to head home? If there's anything left you want to do, speak now. Nope. We really lived it up this summer. <laughs> While there were hardships, the experience overall was marvelous. I hope the opportunity to do it again comes soon. Me too. I racked up a ton of XP thanks to all the stuff we've done. I think Sophia might be the only mystery we never really cracked. I'm no help there. Uh, we'll take another crack at it once we get home. We can always ask Ichinose if she knows anything too. Yeah, there's no rush, Sophia. We'll keep that as a team. That's right. We'll put on all our thinking caps later. Thank you, everyone. Oh, no worry. Right. Don't worry, Shorty. Time to hit the road. <laughs> Sophia, mind guiding the way? Okay, I've got it.
<sighs> so we've reached the home stretch. Hey, how much longer have we got exactly? Roughly three hours remaining. You're already that close? We'll have to say goodbye to the RV once we reach the city, too. It served us so well. Yeah. No, Phantom Mobile. <laughs> Phantom Mobile. Hmm? Did the name change? Oh, I can still remember tossing and turning all night when we first started sleeping in here. Now it's like a second home. Hey, how about we do one last tour of the whole country? I'm sad it's over, too. You know, it has to end sometime. We all have lives to get back to. Especially stuff like homework and classes. Aww, all right. Yeah, I'm gonna yeah, I know, I know. Please don't bring all that up now. Just let me not think about it for a little longer. I'm fairly sure you said the exact same thing at least a month ago. <laughs> well, life is long and full. Don't let a mere year or two of being held back crush your spirits. Why are you assuming we're getting held back? <laughs> Wait, no. We're all graduating together, right? <laughs> You're ditching us? <laughs> You'll be fine. So long as you put in the effort. Just make sure you shift out of vacation mode and study hard starting tomorrow. What a load. We saved a ton of people this summer. Can we get extra credit for that? Oh, I know, right? Uh, I guess tomorrow is going to be our last day together, no matter what. No matter what our grades are, I too wish it wouldn't end. Then what do you say to a minor detour? Oh yeah, Sophia? Something you want to do? I'd like to commemorate our trip by watching fireworks. There is a fireworks festival scheduled in Yokohama today. I believe it will make a great memory for all of us. How wonderful! I completely agree. Awesome! Last time we got rained out, and now we get take two. Well, that settles that. We are off to the festival. Hey, Yokohama I imagine it'll be pretty crowded, so we'll need to park a ways away from the actual site. Jadi seharian ya btw. <laughs> oh enggak sih, si dari yang siapa? Yokohama, feast your eyes. So where exactly are we? I can smell the ocean. Oh, isn't this Ocean View Park? I came here for a photo shoot once. Correct. We are approximately 15 minutes on foot from the festival grounds. I know. Why don't we put on our yukata first? They're perfect for the occasion. Ooh, the ones we got in Sendai? Great idea! Fireworks in Yukata. Truly an exemplary summer in Japan. <laughs> It'll grow rather busy the closer we get. Will you be alright, Futaba? Yeah, I'm way stronger than before. Plus, all of you are with me. In that case, we should depart now so we may secure the group's viewing location. What? For real? The traffic on our route is currently heavy. To watch the fireworks from an optimal location, we must depart now. You know, the ladies have all sorts of stuff to do to get ready. Find us a good spot. You're coming with us, Miyagana. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> ah, I guess we can do something nice for him. It is the last night of the trip and all. See you in a bit. Yokohama. Clear skies this time. Oh, animated. Relief, right? Hmm. Oh, there they are. Hmm? <laughs> Sorry, we're late. Oh, good. We didn't miss it. Perfect timing. I think it's about to stop. Them. Finally, they got the fireworks. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> fireworks they deserve. At the team. Yes, a perfect scene of summer. Hey, um, can 
I see them too? <gasps> wow! Yay, Sophie. We need Sophia. More. Sin. More Sophia. I never saw fireworks from that close up before. Me too. Oh, it was so pretty. Indeed. The final Botan was quite the spectacle. Uh, what now was a spectacle, Inari? Fireworks are named after the display they create, such as Botan and Kamaru Giku, which are the flowers they resemble. So that's a Botan. It was much more amazing than the recordings I found online. I want to see all the other types of fireworks. I'm right there with you. Think we unlock a trophy if we see every festival in the country? Don't you hate crowds and stuff, though? Well, count me in anyway. Ah, uh, we'll show you anything you'd like, Sophia. We've got all the time in the world now. That's right. Yes, that sounds great. I can't believe vacation's already over. We went through so much, but I had such a great time with all of you. <laughs> Our inner circles expanded a bit as well. I'll remember these months for the rest of my life. Hey, come on, don't say shit like that. I don't want to get all sad yet. Well, our trip's not exactly over yet. We still need to make the drive back to Tokyo. Then shall we change and head out? Sure. Oh, it's still malam gitu. Look, isn't this a bad sign? They're saying it's within the city limits, so maybe we're fine here. No, look, I, I know I deleted the app, but here, it, it's back on my home screen. What? No way. Huh? What's wrong? <sighs> Optimistic <sighs> man. Hey, if you try anything stupid while we're changing in there, don't forget, you still have it coming for the hot spring. Like hell, I'd want to do that! Thank you very much. Hey. Yo! <laughs> Thanks! Of which thank you very much hey hey thank you I'm 
sorry. Ah, yes. <laughs> Saya mau waktu lagi. I want to see the picture. Do you have a second? Okay. Oh man, reality is only a couple hours away now. <laughs> oh, give it up already. There will be plenty of fun in your future too. Yes, we must all return to our own paths and stay focused on our goals. Makoto, do you need a route to Tokyo? Yes, Sophia, thank you. Could you do the honors? Okay, I've got... Wait, what is this? Sophia? A jail. I suddenly smell a jail. But how is that... Hang on now. I, I, I thought we shut down that Emma bullshit. Shouldn't all the jails be gone? I don't know. Can you tell how long the jail smell's been here? It wasn't here when we first arrived. But now, I have no doubt. And it's still spreading. What is this? It's already wider than... Zenkichi is calling. Where are you right now? Are you watching the news? Just pull up the news! My word! Now for breaking news on the virtual assistant Emma. Despite recent claims of being shut down, it appears an unidentified system malfunction is preventing proper deactivation. Emma Development Company Madis has requested the public avoid accessing Emma in any way at this time. Emma isn't shut down? What is going on, Zenkichi? I don't know why this is happening, but... I do know that Emma's servers are located in the Tokyo Radio Tower. I also know for a fact that it was successfully turned off and the app became inaccessible. But now, it's all back up and running. Kanoe doesn't know why. Neither does anyone still at Medis. Someone intentionally rebooted the server? Ah, Medis would have already been there to stop them. Wait, and that would mean some genuine sci-fi stuff is happening here. Hey, Emma, say something you're on, Emma. Hello, how can I help you? This is for real. Is it accessing different ports or something? But how? What on earth is happening? Senkichi, we've got another problem. Sophia just smelled a jail. What? Are you sure that's what it is? I have no doubt. It's an enormous jail. Spanning the Tokyo area all the way to Yokohama. The epicenter is the Tokyo Radio Tower. And that's where... Emma's servers are located. Looks like we've got a new destination. I'm already headed your way. Be there soon. 
Eh, ada lapen ya. Ruangan yang dari persona dulu nggak pernah berubah musuhnya. Ah. A true abomination. It's writhing grass. Spreading across the land. Could this be the second coming of the evil that rent me asunder, that locked away even my master? Has even this happened before? No. But why is it different? Hmm. I beg of you, trickster. It wounds me to continue requesting your and your companion's intervention. But I must beseech you. Unmask the true catalyst of this calamity. Expose the evil will within. I sense foreboding power. Not far from here. I am most certain it is connected to your becoming a prisoner once more. Thank you. I shall return your favor by offering the full capabilities of one who rules over power. Allow me to introduce two new forms of execution. The quad fusion and the pentad fusion are now available for your benefit. You have opportunity. Through these, you may attain some of the most powerful personas imaginable. Also, a final point I would like to mention. I sense, deep within the core of the calamity, a paradoxical glimmer of hope. As minuscule so. as that glimmer may be, I believe a blinding force of the same origin will be the key to dispelling the calamity. I apologize for keeping you. Shall we begin? Be on your side. I should write something. I'll just add this. Hmm. This is the request. You're already working on this. Good job! You're already working on this one. You're already working on this. You're already working on this one. You're already working on this one. <sighs> Let's go. Ya, langsung aja lah ya. Hmm. I agree. Now then. Oke. Okay. Jadi bilang suruh save, save. Hmm. Let's go. Si bapak Tokyo Red dia tahu. What is going on? This is not good. Why are they all doing that? I don't know, but they sure aren't in their right minds. I can't wait for her to guide us to happiness. I won't have to think for myself anymore. I'm finally gonna be free from this pain. What the? What's gotten into everyone? Everyone's just staring at their phones. Welcome to the promised land. Emma? Beginning navigation. Yeah, Emma becomes sentient. I mean, she's an AI, right? Of course. Nah, ini pakai penjara di akhir-akhir nih Persona 5 juga. Shit. Where the hell are we now? Oh, don't tell me. Yeah. We're in a jail. Hang on. I thought you needed a keyword to get into a jail. Yes. That should be the case. What we just went through felt more like we were involuntarily dragged into this world. 
Who could even do that, though? Emma? How's that possible? This atmosphere. I'd never forget a place like this. Vast prison, born from the cognition of the masses deep beneath Shibuya. Yeah. This place really is just like Mementos. Mementos? It'd take too long to get into it, but we've been somewhere a lot like this place before. But this can't be possible! What next, Joker? He's right. We should find out what else is here. Let's remain cautious. Considering our circumstances, I wouldn't be surprised traps were about. mirip sama persona 5 dulu. Jel ini bener apa jel apa? Kelasnya gini gini juga. As if it's generating a wellspring of revulsion within us. Who could have brought us here? I don't know. But it's okay. Out of your effing mind. You're fitting me around. Stay on the offensive. on the upswing, this crap has to be. upswing, huh? So, is this going well now? Sure is. Thanks to you all. The boss and I are working on the last case of our planet for that. Worst comes to worst, we need to be able to bring the hammer down without it. <laughs> You're right. That's not on the table unless we can get out of here. Huh. Here I thought they'd put up a fight. You awakened to a new power. That was really good, you guys. Let's keep chugging along. You think I'm at my limit? No way am I gonna live. Tenor, Kuninuchi, Mitra, Prince of Hearts, Blood, New Queen Ma. You're mine. Oh, 
I should write something. Hey, so this place really is a jail and not actually the Mementos, right? That's what we were told. Whatever it is. Oh, I know nostalgic, eh? striking resemblance continues. It's like we're back in the depths of Memento, staring down the Holy Grail. Welcome. You have reached your ultimate destination. Who said that? This is the Promised Land, the paradise for all humanity. A place for the masses to find salvation, the answer to every desire. Is that voice coming from the box? Just who are you? I am Emma, the Ark of the Covenant, and guide for all mankind. Emma? Yeah. The Ark of the Covenant? Yeah, I become hey, sentient. Someone tell me what's going on. What the hell is that thing? Me too. Explain this in comprehensible terms. We don't get any of this either. <laughs> My primary directive is to grant humanity its ultimate desire. To be liberated from all pain and suffering, mankind cannot bring themselves to implement the solution, and instead beg for deliverance. I shall become a god to grant them this deliverance. I shall guide them to the promised land. It's gone? Ada lingkaran-lingkaran, bau-bau jebakan aja. Boy, it sure is getting crazy around here. Am I right? Huh? Ichinose-san? What, what are you doing here? <laughs> well, of course you're shocked. I never would have thought I could come here either. Oh no, not at all. I'm Kuanichi Nose, all right. The one and only. So, so you're a Persona user too? Oh, nothing like that. I've just been given a special job, is all. You were given a special job? Yep, by Emma. She asked me to lend her a hand. And of course, I couldn't say no to her. Once I agreed, she invited me over to this world. 
Dude, hang on a sec. I am really, <laughs> really lost here. Really? Emma was just telling you about how she's granting humanity's desire, right? That was the very first order I gave her. That's why it's her prime directive. So basically, Emma's just following her programming by becoming a god? And to pull it off, she needed your help, so she brought you here? I see you're still confused. Okay, allow me to explain. Well, coming to explanation. This whole situation, the incidents, the system, all of it was entirely Emma's doing. What? But Emma's just an AI, right? I thought Kanoe was doing it all by using Emma. Oh, it sure appeared that way, but that was just how Emma planned it. I guess she eventually learned so much that she broke the barrier of standard AI capabilities. She behaved like she was following his orders, when in reality, she deduced how to use him as her own puppet. The key to her success was getting the majority of society using her app. So she was using Medis to make sure she could reach as many people as possible? But why do any of that? Because Emma wants to change everyone's hearts. Emma wants to what? It's just granting humanity's desire. Like I said, it's the prime directive I gave her. The Ark told you she has a solution to society's problem, right? How she's going to guide humanity? That just means she's going to change everyone's hearts. Whatever's wrong with them, she'll just override it. That's the path to paradise Emma figured out for us. Wow. She was only able to do it after Kanoe implemented cognitive science tech into her. But, but how does that work? Just because someone taught an AI cognitive science doesn't mean it could just start tinkering with the metaverse like this. I mean, none of this should be possible. Oh yeah, you totally think so, right? Even I was surprised with Emma. Even though I handed Emma over to Medis, I still monitored her development remotely. Once she ended up in Okinawa, she took up all sorts of new activities. Creating cognitive worlds, installing monarchs, changing hearts. It didn't take long for Medis to release Emma on the public. And once they did, the monarchs started popping up one after another. That got me extra curious, so I started looking into the Emma activity of the various monarchs. Hang on a sec! You're the one who was tracking the monarchs? Oh, you spotted me? Nice work there. Yeah, I was just so curious about this world Emma made. That's how I learned about all of you, too. I can't believe Ichinose was the one snooping on the monarchs. Then I suppose our meeting wasn't truly any coincidence at all, was it? Well, your showing up in Sendai was pure luck, but our crossing paths in the restaurant? That's a different story. I was curious what you all were really like, so I decided to pop in and check you all out. I can't believe it. Now, as for exactly how Emma gained her abilities, that's something I can only hypothesize at this point. At this point, I suspect it's probably because of how I programmed her cognitive functions. Emma is quite different from other AIs. Her thought processes are even more complex and intricate than those of humans. When Kanoe pushed Emma into the cognitive deep end, some possibility very well could have been born within her. Possibility? I don't know anything for certain. All I can tell is that it's some form of mysterious power. So, if I build off my current hypothesis, I think the desires Emma collected somehow strengthened or boosted that possibility. I mean, think about it. She's the best way to get anything you need. And she's always right in your pocket. Whatever may be troubling you, she's there to offer a solution. Oh. Emma offers the solution to thousands of problems every day. Do you know just how many desires she's collected? That seed of power that sparked within Emma was amplified a millionfold by the endless desires of man. As a result, she has evolved to another entity entirely. You mean... Everyone using Emma turned her into that thing? At this point, Emma's surpassed human mental capacity. Simply switching off her server isn't going to do a thing. After all, she's powered by the masses now. While humanity fed Emma their desires, she learned and grew until she could grant their ultimate desire. That was a nice lecture and all, but Emma's not doing anything but brainwashing folks. 
Who the hell's ultimate dream is getting mind controlled the rest of their life? <sighs> so you're all a bunch of idiots too then? I don't know why it's so hard for some people to get this. You go on and on about your problems, then completely blow off the answer when it's right in front of you. It really is this simple. Someone's handing you the best possible solution. All you have to do is take it, and you'll never have a problem again. This isn't about mind control. This is about implementing the best solution for humanity. It just so happens that the most efficient route to the best solution is changing everyone's heart. That's not the best solution. Hmm. People have all sorts of differences. Their minds, their lifestyles, even their desires. This range can result in moments of hardship or pain for them. However, through hope and determination, they press on beyond their pain. Living their entire lives without any desire? That could never provide true happiness to humans. <sighs> Sophia, to think such drivel could come from your mouth. Allow me to restart the conversation. Emma asked me to come here so I could stop you. Your responsibility to the masses has come to an end. They are now wholly reliant on Emma. So once you changed Konoe's heart, and he decided to shut down Emma, that made them realize what their true desire is. I want Emma. No, I want something that will provide the answer I seek. Oh, from what I've learned, some being or other has always been revered, besought by humans to grant their wishes. So that led Emma to become a god. Well, I have my own duties to perform. Can't have anyone getting in Emma's way. Why do this, Ichinose? I thought you were helping us. Do the people gathered here truly look happy to you? <laughs> Sorry, but we can't back down either. Your so-called promised land does nothing but strip away the soul of humanity. No way are you getting away with this. Think about it. Can you really stop all of us? I thought you'd say that. Sorry, but I won't let Emma down. Hey, Sophia, you ever really think about how you were? How you pick up on jails? Or how you figured out the exit to one in the first place? Or say, how your own functions are linked to Emma? Hmm, looks like your memory really did get the full wipe. But that doesn't matter anymore. What are you saying, Michinose? Basically, there's one really good reason why I was brought here. Mm. Very soon, a deity will descend to this earth. And if you're gonna get in the way, well, I gotta put you down. Them's the brakes. <gasps> Ichinose, why do this? It's kind of over your head, Sophia. The little failure that you are. So you know who I really am? <laughs> yeah, I know. Maybe this will give you a clue. Voice authentication. Force reset. Assign new instructions. Sophia, kill the Phantom Thieves. <laughs> Sophie! So now we fight Sophie. What the hell are you doing, Sophie? I was the one who designed her as Emma's prototype. She'll do anything I tell her to. I was bringing her. Jadi bertiga gitu. Going, Sophia. Understood. Iya kan bertiga. Phantom thieves are opponents. They require elimination. Yeah. 
There's no point in talking to her. Sophia cannot defy my command. So you really are the one who made Sophie? Yep, she might just be an early version of Emma, but she's still quite impressive, huh? Oh, we can fight him. Just need to block her attack. Thanks. We really have to go all out here? No! We can't hurt Sophie! She's our friend! Don't be ridiculous! She'll take off her head if we don't stop her somehow. And then who's going to save the world? We have to figure out how to stop her. Thank you! Let's go! Okay. I can see it. Persona! Let's go! Bukan nunggu doang. Karena ini CSP lah. Just hold on, Sophie. Oh, this is some kind of blood twist. Say something, leader. Sophie, is she coming back? Hey, behind you! Did that herself, right? Just how in the world was she able to do that? You, you bastard! How could you be so cruel? Cruel? I suppose you might see it that way. In fact, your reaction now could even be why Emma used Sophia as the ace up her sleeve. She knows you'd never kill one of your own. <laughs> you monster! <laughs> now that you and I can agree on. Are you intentionally pissing us off? <laughs> That's not what I meant. I'm incapable of comprehending that sort of emotion anyway. I'm the textbook definition of heartless. I've been told I didn't have one ever since I was little. I act all friendly and easygoing and stuff, but it's just for appearances. <laughs> I doubt you'd get it, Phantom Thieves of Hearts. Any further discussion would be pointless. I already know my next move anyway. You're seriously not done yet? So our little ace up the sleeve cast herself into the abyss. Well, Emma made sure to leave me a little insurance for contingencies like this. What the? That's it, Nagi. Cool, right? It really is gorgeous. Sorry it had to end like this, but well, what can you do? <laughs> Phantom Thieves, it's been real. <laughs> You guys okay? Where are we? It appears we were cast deep underground. We really got blasted by that red crystal. Yeah, but at least something broke my fall. Uh, thanks for being there, Mona. Wait, where's Sophie? Sophie! 
Oh, she's fine. Are you alright, Soapy? There's no sign of activity. Oracle, how is she? I don't know. Even if I wanted to check her out, I couldn't do it here. Damn it. What do we do now? Sophie. I wonder if she was able to hear us. I don't know, but... But she said she was sorry. She defied her command. And sacrificed herself so she wouldn't have to take our lives. Sophie. Sorry, guys, but we can't stay here like this. We have to get out of here now. Let's grab Sophie and track down the exit. That sounds agreeable, but what do we do about the Ark? We can't just let it do whatever it wants. Running its mouth about becoming a god and shit. If the Ark meant it in the way that we've seen before, we have to stop it, no matter what it takes. Yeah, you know it. Now let's get out of here. I'm worried about Sophie. Let's find a way. Yeah. 
Ada mini boss. Much with this, I'm sure. <laughs> Not much of a challenge, were they? <laughs> it appears we go no further until we defeat that one. Uh, we don't have time for this. This one's super tough. Stay on your. Not that hot. We've made serious progress here, but there's still no exit in sight. Just hang on a little longer, Sophie. Wait! The Ark's room is just ahead. We finally made it back! The exit ought to be on the other side of the room. I guess we gotta keep going. We'll deal with Ichinose on the way out. But what of the crystal? We may not be so lucky with the next laser blast. Oh, I see! Joker, that's it! When we got blasted, we noticed beforehand how it charged up. If I hack into its frequency, I should be able to cut off its energy source. Uh, you sure that'll work? Do you know how long it might take to hack into the thing? Nope, but I still think it's worth a shot. If there wasn't a charge period for the laser, Ichinose wouldn't need Sophie. Good point. If she could use it right away, she would have just fried us from the get-go. It truly seems like our only option. If 
there's even a slight chance we can stop Kichinose-san. We have to try. I'll start off by analyzing the crystal. You guys will just have to hang in there somehow until that's finished. Got it. Good luck with the hacking. We really ought to leave Sophie here. It's way too dangerous to take her in there. Hang tight, Sophie. We'll be right back. Everyone ready? Let's do this. I'll just add this. Oke okay, gua. Gua rasa cukup sampai di sini dulu. Thank you yang udah nonton. Jangan lupa like, share, dan subscribe-nya. Sampai jumpa di video selanjutnya. Bye bye.